considered the second most feared shark after the great white, tiger sharks have an imposing presence anywhere you find them. It is often spotted in the Sea of Cortez at the National Marine Park of Cabo Pulmo, where this time, divers of the project had no luck in finding it. After we failed, well, not exactly failed, after not being able to find tiger sharks in Cabo Pulmo, part of the team decided to go to the Bahamas, to Tiger Beach, which is the best place in the world to interact with tiger sharks. It is usually a voracious creature, feeding off on turtles, various fish, mollusks, crustaceans, and carrion. People have found all kinds of objects and even pieces of other tiger sharks in their stomachs. It usually exceeds 9 feet in length and it's not uncommon to find specimens that grow 16 to 22 feet, with weights ranging between 1500 pounds and more than a ton. In order to find tiger sharks, you don't really need to search for them directly. Many times you don't have to track the sharks, you have to look for their prey in order to get to them. It was spectacular over there in Bahamas because we had the chance to see several species of sharks. It is gray and has very characteristic dark stripes on its dorsal skin, similar to those of tigers, hence the name. On the ventral side, it is white and its jaws and rows of teeth are very powerful. You can see its force in the way they attack their prey. Once you're in with the sharks, risk is always a factor. Having a lot going on around you, sometimes you may forget things. You need to get those images but also watch out for your colleagues and always have the sharks in sight. Then comes the adrenaline rush, with a 45 minute underwater work session ahead. In the waters of Bahamas, it is also possible to encounter other kinds of sharks. Down there, we had the chance to see the great hammerhead shark, which is somewhat a lonesome creature and very different from the kind we have here in Mexico, mostly in the Sea of Cortez and Revilla Quejedo. Many lemon sharks, nurse sharks, and reef sharks. For Becky, the photographer, sharks are misunderstood. I think sharks are very misunderstood and so many people still think they're man-eaters and they just have a bad reputation. And we see sharks in a whole different way when we dive with them. We see that you know they're very curious, but they're also very afraid of us at the same time. To be able to dive near them, we recommend extreme caution and not to invade their territory, something that can make them irritable and aggressive.